know, I'm back with another video for y'all boys, man. And A, hey, bruh, how are y'all feeling today, bruh? Hey, today I'll be showing you guys the best catfish post score build in NBA 2K22. Now, would I say that this post score build can do everything in the game? This post score build can do everything in the game. This build is a glass cleaning finisher, it gets Hall of Fame finishing and shooting badges, and has a 73 pointer at 99 overall. This build can play make, it can shoot, it has amazing defense. Like as you guys can see from the clips at the beginning of the video, this build is a demon, it can do literally everything, and it's probably the best catfish post score build in NBA 2K22. Now, if you've been watching me for a little bit, you know I do love my post score builds, and I think this is the best one I've ever made. Just because it's a glass cleaning finisher and you have Hall of Fame shooting badges, nobody's gonna know that you can shoot and they're gonna be so confused when you're popping, dribbling, and doing all that stuff. But hey, I'm not gonna waste too much of y'all's time. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, turn on the post notifications, and let's get into it. So for the position of this build you want to make it a power forward now You can go center and make it a little bit different But if you go power forward you can get some badges like chef and stuff that you wouldn't be able to get if you were a center So you literally just get more badges and the stats are a little bit better if you go power forward Handedness and jersey number are both personal preference. They don't really matter now for the pie chart You want to go with this one right here the second one down which gives you Hall of Fame shooting and finishing badges Like I said before now the physical profiles and stuff you, if you've watched my other videos, you know that speed really is, is essential if you're not going to make a 7'3 post score. And strength does not matter unless you're 7'3. So I'm going to go pure speed. You can go speed, very, you can put strength on it if you want to. It doesn't really matter. It's all up to you. But I'm going to go pure speed. Now for the attributes, you can do this however you want. You can still get the build name like with a lot of different ways you make it. But if you want to make it like I do, just make it how I do. So you want to max out your close shot max your standing dunk and max your post hook now you do not need a driving layup or a driving dunk in this game if you're making a post score a lot of people know that already then you want to max your midi your three pointer and your post fade for 16 shooting badges so you get hall of fame shooting badges on a post score and 16 shooting badges that's a lot of shooting badges bro like that's ridiculous you're gonna be such a catfish and people aren't gonna know how to guard you now you're gonna bring your pass accuracy to a 60 and then you want to max out your post control. So you should have nine playmaking badges. Then you have 182 attributes remaining for your defense. So you want to max out your interior, your lateral, max out both of your rebounds, max out your block, and then put the rest on whatever. You can put it on perimeter D if you want to be able to hedge a little bit better. It doesn't really matter. You only have nine attribute points. Or you can put it on your steel to help with your steel a little bit. Now I'm going to put it on my steel so you get your nine defensive badges. You also get that if you put it on your perimeter D, but I think steel is a little bit more valuable just with the nine attribute points. So 18, 16, 9, and 9 is your bad spread. Now this is really good for a catfish. Like when you think of post scoring, you think of a build that's literally just dominant inside and has decent playmaking. This build is like really well oriented all around. Since the def okay, the defense, nine defensive badges isn't a lot, but you are seven foot, you're gonna be seven feet tall, and you're gonna have max link span. So if you have decent defense, decent stick on this game, you don't have to worry about the defense. Playmaking, you have nine playmaking badges, you're fine. Shooting, 16 shooting badges for the Hall of Fame shooting badges on a post score. Like that's insane. And then obviously finishing is really good. It's your best attribute stat by far. Now for the body shape, I go like small on these type of builds because it just makes your defender even more confused. I'm gonna go compact on this type of build. Actually, I'm gonna go solid on this build. Now for the height, like I said before, you are gonna wanna go seven feet tall. And then for the weight, it's all up to you, but I'm gonna drop it a little bit until your interior defense is a 70. So I'm gonna go 225 for the weight. Now you can do whatever you want, but I just think I want the 70 interior defense. Now you're gonna max out your wingspan. And look, a 94 standing dunk, 90 close shot, 89 post hook, a 66 three ball off rip. So you'll have a 73 ball at 99 overall, not including like a sleeve. So you can literally have a 71 three ball in this build if you put a sleeve on. That's insane. And then the defense isn't that bad. Now for the post takeovers, 
I'm gonna go post scoring takeover just because I wanted to be like known that I'm a post scorer so that people think I'm just gonna be like dominant inside and then they're gonna be all confused whenever I'm over here a post scorer takeover and I'm over here popping and shit. So my player build complete and as you can see you have been a glass cleaning finisher in NBA 2K22 with shades of Kevin McHale, Wendell Carter Jr. and Jaren Jackson Jr. Now this build is just like I said before it's probably the best catfish post score build in the game right now. Now this wasn't that long of a video. I'm not really gonna do the badges because if you want to do all like look at the badges and stuff, you can go to my other post score videos and that'll give you a good like representation of the badges to use. But, hey, this can be the end of the video, bro. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, turn the post notifications. Help me get to 3,000 subscribers, and I'm out, man. Life get crazy when the lights off. Shorty on my phone, get the night on. Late on the road, the lights on. Too much time on the road, I can stay long. Don't fuck any stars, I can't chase one.